Hi, I'm Donna Dewberry. We're painting one stroke painting today. I am in love with multi-surface book art paint. So let me tell you, I'm going to paint a hummingbird and I'm going to use the uh, dark green, sap green, a lime green or, or citrus green, a white and a magenta. And you can use red also like an apple red if you choose to. Depends on what color you want your hummingbird. Now, I'm going to teach you a quick and easy way to make a hummingbird. So we're going to take and have two colors going here. Usually it's white and green, so I'm going to pick up some white and work that in so it's a bright green along with a dark green. All right, this is a two brush deal here. There's the first brush. We want it two thirds full of paint. And then that was a 12. And now I've got a 10 and I'm gonna come in and this is gonna be the cheek and the tummy. So it's going to be half magenta and half white. If you're not next to each other, you stroke there. I mean, you pick up magenta and you go and pick up white. Let me show you another way to load a smaller than a 12 brush. As you do all magenta, and let's turn it around, and side stroke the white. Okay? And that's sometimes easier to work it in on a smaller brush, depending on what size you do your, your hummingbird. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to do a half of a grape. So we're going to do half of a grape. Okay? And then we're going to take and make a one stroke long leaf. All right? Now, you can see, I'm going to get a teeny bit of medium. Watch this. My, my dark green was dry, so I can get a little bit of a medium. See where it's dry there? So we're going to come along here and stroke the body. Now, this is the head and the back. Now, I've got the pink. Now, I'm going to go inside the circle. All right? I don't want Popeye. I want to be right in the middle here. So we're going to do... A teardrop stroke. See that? It's a petal of a flower, kind of, usually. And it's like from here to there. All right, so see how it's in the circle? Now what you're going to do, I just got some more paint because I'm using a smaller brush. I'm going to come from there, and I'm going to push down and make his tummy, or her tummy. There you go. And I'm not worrying about that line, okay? You can work that in if you want, but you don't have to. 